I think it's time I show my face here again on YouTube. I appreciate all the comments and the concerns and the messages like, am I okay? When am I putting videos out? Where's the content? Um, I'm still here, Schumacher Chevrolet of Livingston. I am doing very well and actually have just been extremely, extremely busy in the month of July. Uh, currently it is August 2nd, it's Friday, August 2nd. And uh, even this month, like I already have a, a, a bunch of stuff in the works as far as uh, new and pre-owned sales. I just showed this 2024 Colorado. However, I did not sell this one. Customers came in looking at a pre-owned one, which I ended up selling them. We did look at a new one just to compare, you know, pricing and the deal and all that. But this 2019 is the car, or I should say truck for them. So we're gonna stop by real quick. We're gonna put a sold sign in it. That's this one right here. In this video, I'm gonna kind of just get you updated on, on what's been going on. It's just, again, been very, very busy. Last month, at one given point, I had over 30 cars sold. I ended up finishing the month with 25 cars delivered. I had two or three deals. I think two deals carry over to August, and I had three people cancel out the deal that they originally had written. So very, very busy month, which is awesome, and we're hoping August is the same. I do have the breakdown here for you on what I sold and delivered last month. We delivered nine used cars. We'll kind of leave it at that. They're just a variety of different vehicles. We sold 16 and delivered 16 new cars. Number one, as far as the most volume was the Chevy Trax. We did four Chevy Traxes. We did two brand new Chevrolet Tahoes, two of the brand new 2024 Chevy Traverses. We did two Equinox EVs. We did one Blazer EV, two Corvettes, which was awesome. It's always fun selling the Corvettes. And we did one Equinox LT, the gas version. Those were the 16 that we sold. So great month, great product being sold. People very happy with uh, what Chevy has been offering. Especially with the EVs, like the Equinox and the Blazer EV in our area has been doing very well for us uh, so far. You know, we're only, a, we're only a few months in to really having a decent supply of these vehicles. Uh, we're about 30 minutes outside of New York. In this area, I can tell you, is Tesla country. Every four or five vehicles that you pass, you'll pass a Tesla. Like, they're literally everywhere. And I think uh, with Chevy offering something different than that Model 3 and Model Y, which are so popular around here, I feel we're gonna get a lot of business. A lot of people are gonna come in and they're gonna go with an Equinox EV or a Blazer EV. Oh, we also, we got our first Silverado EV in. Now it wasn't mine, mine is a white one. For some reason it is still on hold at the factory. We had a black one come in, which was the other launch edition because we got two launch edition trucks. It's already been sold and delivered. It sold the next day it came in, $96,495 I believe and uh it really is an awesome truck i didn't get a chance to drive it i didn't even get a chance to sit in the thing like it was here that fast and uh, like i said i've just been uh been very busy wall tree over here looking good growing very well nice and green getting bigger it's doing great if you look at our lot here right now, it's a bit of a shambles. I mean, we got stuff sort of all over the place. It's out of order. Things aren't really parked all that great. We'll get out here and we'll adjust all this. We got a couple of Tahoes in. We got some Colorados in. Chevy Trax is in. A whole bunch of Traverses that have showed up. You know, so we have a, a nice selection of inventory. We still have a whole load of the gas Equinox. These are the 2024s. And actually, I'm just remembering now, we got our first 2025 Equinox in, which is right over here. I'll take you over and show you real quick. This is a front wheel drive LT. This is gonna sell phenomenally, this new model Equinox. It looks really nice. Sleeker design, it has sort of like that Trailblazer type look, a little more, um, more truck-like compared to the previous uh, generation. And it is locked, but it has all the new uh, screens and all that sort of stuff, that new Chevrolet look as far as the big horizontal screen, both for your infotainment and also for your instrument cluster. So we're really excited about that. This is nice, just, just came in the other day. Brand new 2025 uh, Chevy Trax in the color Cypress Gray. Really like that, I think it looks good. Something a little different, something that uh, is brand new for 2025. So again, I appreciate the, the folks that are looking for my content and I'm sorry I haven't gotten anything up on the computer for like a month, you know, but it's amazing how 
busy we got last month. It's also July, so it's vacation months. Now we only have five salespeople here. So for instance, when people are off, now you're only talking four salespeople. Then you have people go on vacation for a week. So now you're talking in some days you only have three salespeople. There were some days we only had two. Tuesdays are my day off. And last month I worked three of those Tuesdays just because the, the floor was empty and it was a good opportunity to sell cars, which paid off. I sold 25 cars. So, you know, it was something that uh, I put a lot of work in here at the dealership. Didn't quite get to put the same work into YouTube, but I'm going to try to figure out some sort of a schedule where I can do that because I recently purchased something. And if you follow me on Instagram at my, uh, Instagram page of Day of Dave, you'll already know that I bought myself a brand new 2024 Chevrolet Corvette. I also went to Corvette Academy in Bowling Green, Kentucky. I flew into Nashville, drove up to Bowling Green, went to uh, a Corvette training where we got to drive on the track. Okay, guys, we're gonna take a deep breath, make sure we're relaxed and focused. Go ahead and start to rear back on the gas pedal here. Here we go. Alright, don't do the main thing. Maybe it's a little faster now. Over to the right. Yeah. Slow it up and we're going. Okay, we're going to the right on the gas, a little more down the hill. I also recently went to a Blink-182 concert, which was a blast. I have footage from these experiences, which I'm going to put into um, into videos, so stay tuned. Nia's gonna end us with whatever she <laughs> wants tuned. to say or do. <laughs>